Inflation in its simplest form is the rise in the general price level of goods and services over time. But here's the catch. It comes in various shapes and sizes, each with its unique characteristics and implications. Let's break them down. Our first stop is demand pull inflation. This occurs when the demand for goods and services exceeds their supply, leading to a surge in prices. It's like a bidding war and consumers end up paying more for the same goods. Next up we have cost push inflation. Imagine the cost of producing goods and services rises, perhaps due to increased raw material prices or higher wages. In turn, businesses pass these costs on to consumers, causing prices to soar. Now, built-in inflation takes us into the realm of wage price spirals. When workers demand higher wages, businesses in turn increase prices to maintain their profit margins. This cyclical process can lead to a never-ending loop of rising prices. Hyperinflation is the extreme end of the spectrum. This occurs when prices skyrocket uncontrollably, rendering the currency nearly worthless. It's a rare phenomenon, but when it happens, the consequences are severe. Lastly, stagflation challenges conventional economic wisdom. It's a situation where high inflation coexists with economic stagnation and high unemployment, a perplexing combination that poses unique challenges for policymakers.